A woman admits to killing her own wife and trying to bury her in Port Charlotte. The Sarasota County Sheriff's Office is now investigating after they say the woman called 911 to report this murder. Thanks for joining us tonight for Fox 4 News at 10. I'm Lisa Greenberg. The couple lived together at a home in Inglewood. Four in your corners, Karis Belger spent the day in her neighborhood talking to people living nearby about this couple. Karis? Lisa, when I went to Overbrook Road where Winkler lived with her wife, all the neighbors I spoke to said the exact same thing. They barely recognized Winkler and were shocked that this kind of thing could happen on their street. This was what Overbrook Road in Inglewood looked like on Sunday. Sarasota Sheriff's Office patrol cars surrounding this home. Investigators collecting evidence. A scene neighbors never expected to see. Our, our first reaction was just seeing all the police officers pull up the following day. The reason why was even more of a surprise. Sarasota County deputies say it all started Saturday when deputies arrested this woman, 48 year old Jessica Winkler. They say she called 911 admitting she killed her own wife, Rhiannon Landecker. Deputies say when they got to her Inglewood home, her wife's body was wrapped in a blanket inside of her car. Investigators determined Winkler planned to bury her at a home in Port Charlotte. One neighbor who didn't want to be identified says she had no idea the couple on the corner had any sort of problems. I don't know, their house is kind of weirdly shut off from the neighborhood, so who knows? Anything can make someone go crazy. <laughs> Another neighbor says they never saw Winkler and rarely saw her wife. She said the one we've never really seen and the other one, she just sits out in front of her garage on a daily basis. Hearing Winkler admitted to killing her own wife makes them question how well they know their neighbors. I don't know, it's nuts. Now you have that person like, what, not even a block away from you. Now, deputies I spoke to said they, it was most likely a domestic dispute that turned deadly, with Land Decker, that's Winkler's wife, dying after being shot. Tonight, Winkler is still behind bars, and the investigation is still ongoing. Karis Belger, Fox 4. All right, thank you so much, Karis. A killer is on the run.